Hey folks, um, so today's project is a, um, I guess it's a repair to the, uh, to the Prusa Mark III. Um, I recently uh, started having what I would call adhesion problems with the first layer. Um, and uh, I found that in the end, um, even though when I'd set the temperature, let's say for 90 degrees for a PETG, um, and when I checked it with the old uh, thermometer, it was between 15 and 20 degrees cooler than the 90 degrees. And so I thought, okay, that's not good. That's probably it's a mister problem. But then I also noticed that the temperature was different depending on where I measured it. And so it was generally warmer and hotter down at the bottom left here. And up at the front right, it was uh, cooler. And so I could see when I, I remove models from the bed that the, um, if you like, the quality of that first layer was highly variable between this, you know, this corner and that corner. Uh, if you're printing a really small model, I guess it doesn't matter, but bigger stuff, it was a problem. So I figured I'd replace the bed since it comes with a thermistor anyway. And so we'll get rid of both birds with one stone. The other thing I haven't been happy with on this is the noise that the uh, regular linear bearings make. They really rattle uh, like something is loose, but I've checked everything. There's nothing loose, so it can only be the balls in these linear bearings. So I have some Igus bearings uh, and I'm going to put those on because I put those on my Mark II point in the beginning and it's been stellar. I mean, no problems and that's at least two years of service at this point. So, we're just going to start taking this thing apart and uh, go from there. nicer. <clears throat> oh, that is so much nicer. Finally, finally. Okay, so that's kind of the, uh, that's the work done. Uh, so we will uh, have a little pause here, tidy up, put the tools away, and we will come back for some testing. And so there we go. Uh, I forgot to turn on the camera, so I didn't get to do the calibration. But it went really without a hitch. Um, and so my temperature seems to be much more accurate now on the bed. And there's no more of that rattling noise when the uh, bed goes back and forth. And so that was definitely the bearings. Uh, so yeah, all in all, I'm pleased with the, uh, how this has turned out. And uh, it'll be a lot less distracting now when this thing is printing. <laughs> right, uh, I hope some of that was at least interesting and uh, yeah more to come. <laughs> 